name is Adelaide Abio Williams, CEO, SES HD+. Today, we welcome a very important woman from the SES SA world to Ghana. Her name is Pan McDonald. Today, we also have a very important activity, which is to launch two initiatives around diversity, equity, and inclusion here in Ghana. I am an avid traveler. I like traveling in many countries, personal time and professional time. And Ghana is one of the few countries I've never been to. I've heard incredible things about the country, so I had to come. Obviously, we have um, uh, offices here. We have an incredible uh, part of our workforce being based here. To be honest, I probably needed much more time than the time I spent. So before I came to the trip, you know, I heard about, you know, it's the, I knew about it's the Ghana. So I, I researched, uh, people sent me material, I looked into it. Then today, the team was kind enough to spend the whole day with me to explain different things. And I think one of the things that resonated to me is that it's the Ghana seems to be the future. And I can see through the different presentations and the different explanations how it's almost like we are setting up the level of where the future is going to be. And we're going to be there first. And we're going to be there with a the lady. A very warm welcome to the Maiden Leaders Experience event by HD Plus to share the extraordinary journeys to success of remarkable women and inspire others to lead. Today, we make history collectively as we come together to break barriers, inspire and empower all women to aim for the stars and shatter any bias that may stand in their way. We need to tap into the power of female vision because the space is dominated by males. The spaces are dominated. There's no doubt about that. But we have to move forward with a commitment of breaking down barriers, embracing diversity, creating an inclusive world where all of us, regardless, of our gender will still be able to fulfill our leadership potential. On behalf of SES HD+, the entire team, crew, and every single guest in here, I'd like to extend a very hearty vote of thanks to all our speakers and panelists for gracing this event and sharing your stories with us today. We are grateful.